Hi guys, today we're working on this cute miniature trolley suitcase. I went for a vintage floral look, but you can customize it however you want. Let's get started. The first thing you're gonna need is some popsicle sticks, a pair of scissors, and a file. Cut your sticks to the size you need them and file away any rough edges. Then get out some glue, I'm using tacky glue, and glue your sticks together side by side to create the surface you need. For the sides I'm using these thinner stirring sticks. Cut them to size and glue them on. We're basically making an open box. Let it dry and that's the front of our suitcase. I made the back a little deeper using two stirring sticks for the sides. Since the stirring sticks come a little uneven, you might need to file them to make a good fit. Once the two pieces fit nicely together, you can go around the outside with the file to make everything smooth. Now pick your fabric. I went for this vintage floral one for the outside and this shiny green one for the inside. Then get out a thick fabric glue and a fine pair of scissors and start gluing the inside fabric in place. Be sure to cover the edges as well, so we're sure not to have wood showing later. Then flip it around and glue the outside fabric in place. When you've done and cut away all the excess, get out a thinner fabric glue and add this to all the edges so they don't fray. Next we're gonna make the pull-up handle using some wire and some pliers. Cut off a piece of wire and use the pliers to form a squared hook. Glue a piece of fabric around the top for the handle. To attach it to the back of the suitcase, you're gonna need to cut out some stone sticks in this kind of frame-like pattern. Glue them to the back 
and then glue a piece of fabric on top of it to keep it all in place. To attach the front and back of the suitcase together, you're gonna need some hinges. I got these miniature doll sized hinges from eBay and I used a strong glue to stick them on. And there you go, that's the basic suitcase. Now we're gonna add some decoration. I used these two colors of alcohol markers to color some white ribbon because I couldn't get the ribbon color I wanted. Get out a small pair of jump rings and then start gluing the ribbon around the suitcase. Add the jump rings on the ribbon on one side to be the buckle. For the little corner patches, I used the same markers as before to color some white linen fabric, then cut out a circle with a triangle missing and glue these onto the edges. To make the regular handle, I used a few drum rings, glued some ribbon in between the two, and then used more ribbon to glue it onto the bag. For the back wheels, I used a piece of wire and a few beads. Cut two small pieces of stirring stick and glue them on opposite the wheel so the suitcase can stand. Then add some gold studs onto the corners for decoration. Let everything dry and there you go, that's a miniature suitcase done. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video, leave me a like if you did and subscribe if you want to see more. Bye!